I do believe absolutely within the meat industry. When it comes to the environment and sustainability, if you stand still and don't do the right thing, you'll be left behind. My name is Melissa Fletcher. I'm part of Fletcher International. We can process up to four million head per year, depending on the capacities that we're running at. We can process around 18,000 a day. Here at Fletcher's, uh, we've grown from humble beginnings uh, to be the largest processor of sheep meat in Australia, also the largest processor of wool. We export to customers in over 90 countries. So when you export to 90 countries around the world, you have a lot of demands and fluidity that you need to satisfy. It is a challenge that I wake up with every day. It's inherent for me to do things smarter, not harder. One of the major components in our business is that the animal has nearly doubled in size over the last 20 years. And that changes everything within your facility. The amount of energy that goes into that one animal to process. And if we don't evaluate and look and monitor and audit and meter, we don't know the real costs. And if we don't, we are going to become very uncompetitive in Australia. And that's where we embarked with SMZ, having a look at where we're going. More than 10% of the industrial electrical energy generated in Australia goes into compressing air. The process of compressing air is extremely inefficient and in fact can be as low as 20% efficient. The Energy Conservation Group was developed to work with our customers to identify waste and unlock opportunities to improve the energy efficiency and to reduce costs. We conducted plant-wide surveys to identify compressed air energy usage at each of the process areas. And this involved the use of extensive monitoring at processes and production machinery and took several months. Much of the new technology and product development was unique to SMC, specially designed products built at our Australian and New Zealand manufacturing centres have now been introduced at Fletcher's and have also been exported globally. The use of leading edge serial communications combined with monitoring technology now permits instant access to the critical compressed air parameters. A recent test identified zero perceivable air leakage across the site. This is almost unheard of and certainly a first experienced in Australia and New Zealand. This project not only gave us the ability to install innovative solutions and retrofit to existing machinery, but also gave us the opportunity to work closely with at least four machine builders to introduce innovative new technology and solutions that make local designs world competitive from an efficiency and energy perspective. So having SMC do this audit, it made us also understand not only did we have the impact of a, of a saving straight away from reducing our, our kilowatts of 165 down to 110 kilowatts, but what it did do was absolutely switch on on what else can be saved. The outcome to date resulted in recent installations of smaller, lower powered compressors, and improved machinery efficiency with the associated lower energy costs and initial savings identified of approximately $50,000 a year. Even while the site has been growing and production has increased. What we took away from this project was that the successes are jointly owned and derived from working with Fletchers, not just for Fletchers. This success comes from passion, commitment and engagement of both companies. Fletcher's relationship with SMC has been critical to our strategy. We see it as imperative that we're moving very quickly as our consumers' demands change. Suppliers like SMC have a proven track record of supplying those efficiencies which help us a lot to attain our goals around sustainability. 
and efficiency into the future. I think it's really important to get the messages out there of things that can be done smarter if it means that we're making the world a more sustainable environmental place to be happy with. We are in it together. We have to be in it together.